Eggs are a divisive topic in the world of nutrition. Some call them superfoods, while others say they're one of the worst things you can consume. Those claiming they're terrible often point to the high cholesterol content. I've discussed this before, but consuming cholesterol can have different effects in different people. If you take a vegan who eats no cholesterol and you start adding cholesterol to their diet, their LDL cholesterol levels in their blood can shoot up. But if you take someone already eating an animal-heavy diet and add more cholesterol to their diet, it won't really do much. And there are other factors like genetics that play a role in how an individual will respond to cholesterol. Plus, it's worth noting that cholesterol has a smaller effect overall than saturated fat does. Nonetheless, there's research on eggs specifically and how they affect LDL cholesterol and ApoB levels in the form of this systematic review and meta-analysis of 66 randomized controlled trials. And the results suggest that consuming an egg per day can lead to a clinically meaningful rise in both LDL cholesterol and ApoB, which would be expected to increase cardiovascular disease risk. Further, prospective cohort studies suggest that each half egg consumed per day increases risk of cardiovascular disease about about 6 to 7 percent. But what you're eating eggs instead of also matters. So eating eggs in place of plant protein sources may increase risk, whereas eating eggs in place of meat may even decrease risk. So that's one reason we get mixed results in different studies. Another reason we see mixed results is in a lot of studies, the difference between low and high egg consumers is very small. I don't expect to see a significant difference in risk between people consuming two or four eggs a week, for example. Where we do tend to see risk is when it's closer to an egg a day.